Now, do you sometimes feel like working for yourself means you have to do a hundred different things and you've got a hundred different bosses breathing down your neck? Or do you end up in client underlying relationships where you are the underling? And does that mean having more clients uh, literally means having more to do's? Now, what if it didn't have to be like that? What if there was a better and easier way to have a business that's profitable and enjoyable? What if you could get every one of your clients results in the first 48 hours? And what if those results would instantly build trust and credibility in the marketplace? And what if, you know, those same clients started seeing you different from your competition or your competitors? What if they saw you as an investor or a highly skilled consult consultant instead of an underling that they can actually boss around? Well, this could be possible for you if you were absolutely clear on what payoff you are giving your clients. Now, if you're ready to escape the trap of working for money and being your client slave, I want you to strap yourself in because inside this video, you're going to learn some of the most massive wealth and time and leverage shortcuts that are used by some of the most successful coaches and consultants on the planet. Now you're going to discover a model of running a business that's profitable and enjoyable. What's up coaches, consultants, and business owners? It's Prosper here with Live Long Digital, the number one digital marketing agency for service-based business owners like yourself, where we help you build a business that's profitable and enjoyable. And today, I'm going to walk you through designing your business model. Now, this video will have you picking your business model apart or your revenue strategy, the actual way you're going to be making money in your business so that you're only working with people that pay, stay and refer and have a business that's profitable and enjoyable. But before we check this out and how it all works, be sure to subscribe to our Live Long Digital YouTube channel because you do not want to miss out on any of our amazing strategy videos that will teach you how to make more money with less struggle. So throughout these emails and these videos, we've discovered, you know, the kind of people you want to work with. We've identified your target market. We've clarified your message. We've discovered what sort of pain you solve and what, um, you know, payoff you will be giving your audience. And we've found out a lot about you and what you actually bring to your business. And if you haven't done any of the prior work or the prior videos or the prior action plans, maybe stop this video and go back to those videos so that you can actually be aligned with the next step of where we are heading towards. Because right now we're going to be talking about the actual product, the actual thing that people pay you for when people receive a, a receipt or you know a credit card statement what are those items that they're actually paying for because if it's a subscription if they cannot uh, explain this to their board members or if they cannot explain this to their spouse or whoever is involved in their business they are actually going to cancel your services so you need to be absolutely clear on what it is that you're actually offering in terms of the product. And we've gone over, you know, to the other side where we have uh, taken a look at your ideal clients, um, who they are and what they're really looking for and what their pain um, is or what their desires are. Now it's the time for us to actually bridge the gap between those two and we design a business that actually solves that pain or that desire that your ideal clients have. So there's a couple of sections within this step and the very first one that we're going to cover in this video is for you to actually pick your business model. 
the actual revenue strategy, how you're going to be making the money in your business. Now, the, these are the products or the programs, the services that you're going to be selling. How are you packaging them in such a way that they're appealing to your identified target market and they can defend them on the receipt, um, you know, on their credit card statement. Now, you may be saying, well, I'm a coach or I'm a consultant, so I'm going to be selling coaching and consulting out there, which is what exactly every other coach, consultant or small business owner is saying out there. If you're not going to be differentiating yourself enough for you to win, um, you know, the hearts and minds of your customers, then it will be grand opening, grand closing. So I want to tell you that there's, there's a lot of revenue strategies out there. And as an expert, there are also a lot of ways that you can be actually making money in your business. There's loads of ways that you can package this expertise because your life story and your life experience have great, tremendous value to whoever's going to be listening and learning from you. And people are paying for a shortcut. So if you can package that shortcut well enough for them to truly look at you as the person that can solve their problem, guess what? You are on the money. So I'm going to go through some of these different business uh, models that are out there and I've given you a handout that you can look at that's going to help you decide which one is the best fit for you. So if you haven't downloaded the handout, just stop the video now. Okay, and download the handout that comes in your email. That way you can see all um, the business models and the little explanations that I have done for you so that you can see how you can actually structure your business. And it's going to be based on what you like to do, how you like to do it, and what your experience is, and especially how you like to spend your time. Because the main reason why we start our business or we go out and venture by ourselves is so that we buy our own freedom. And if you have um, the handout, I have outlined all the business models that I think would be, um, you know, crucial for you to actually start implementing within your business. That way you have a business that's profitable and enjoyable. So right now I invite you to come and watch my screen so that we can go through the business models and the revenue strategies and the list of business models that you can follow through because right now you might not be maximizing or getting the actual economic efficiency within your business only simply because you are running it on a model that is not sustainable. So come on over and before maybe we do that, just make sure you've downloaded your uh, handout so that you can follow through uh, while I show you on the screen um, on, on, on the other page there. So here's hoping that you have downloaded the handout that I mentioned and you're going to be following through as we go along. It is quite comprehensive. As you can see, we have managed to put down quite a lot of um, information so that you are, you know, starting off on the right footing there. And I will leave this, um, you know, available and up to you to make a decision what sort of uh, business model you're going to be following through. But I'll try and explain just a few uh, beats there so that we are all, um, you know, sort of aware what is expected of us and how we can actually make the most uh, money as we go along. Okay. So for example, let's say you're a coach. Okay. And you hate being holed up in the office all day, but most of the coaches that you know do maybe telephone coaching and they're always on the computer or on the phone and they never get to go out in the real world. Well, you won't, you wouldn't want to design your coaching business like that because it goes against who you are and it's not what you like to do. So if you know anything about business, it's that if you're going to be forcing yourself to do stuff that you are not keen on you're not going to be doing it for a very long time it's just simple arithmetic okay so you want to design um you know your business according to the person that you are and design your programs and then market them so that you can actually conveniently be the person that can offer that service 
And if travel is not what you want to do, or you want to be traveling out, or you want to be working remotely with your clients, it makes it super, super easy for you to then, um, you know, be the person that can make that happen. So when I started my business, uh, you know, um, it was all about marketing consulting and I'm located here in Melbourne and I live a little bit further from the city. So not all my clients are local. So I had to go out and meet people in their offices and they couldn't come to my place because I was working from home. So what I then created was an internet based um, you know, concierge of an office where people can uh, see my work online and don't need to necessarily meet me in person, you know? So I was, I picked a different business model, um, you know, that was consistent to me. I was very comfortable in dispensive, uh, dispensing all this advice in my area of expertise. That's why I chose um, video as a model that I was, um, you know, using. And I knew that they, you know, there was a, there's a, an audience that was out there that was willing to pay for my uh, expertise. I even added a coaching component um, because I wanted to be able to reach more people and I wanted to be able to work virtually. Long before 2020 hit where we were actually forced to work from home, I had already designed my business that had training programs, information products, and, you know, Zoom coaching and consulting and I marketed to pick people around the world. That is what actually made me successful. And I'm the kind of person that's not shy to be, you know, in front of a, cam in, in front of a camera and I also prefer to work with fewer clients and I'm comfortable charging a higher fee. So you need to find out that about yourself. And it's very important for you to select the model that best fits you and your lifestyle that you want to have. And also one that's going to get you and your financial goals the quickest and most effectively there. All right. So there's some other things that you, um, you know, better start looking at. Like maybe you just want to do a virtual business with subcontractors. There's so many places where you can hire virtual assistants to help you build your business or you want to work, um, you know, in uh, freelancer places like FIFA or Elance or things like that. So this um, you know, uh, you know, handout that I've given you, it gives you a lot uh, to think about how you want to uh, create your business model. So make sure you have downloaded this and then just go through it and find out which actually works for you so that you too can be, do and have a business that's profitable and enjoyable because some things are just better you discovering for yourself and also just, um, you know, having an idea of who you are and where you want to um, go to. And that way you can actually start creating the business for yourself right there. So there you have it. Your business model is going to be what determines how you're going to be making money and how you're going to be delivering the service. Um, you know, out there to your clients and those that are going to be paying you money. So you need to make sure that you're comfortable in delivering this service. You're comfortable in showing up consistently because your life story and your experience is what people are looking for and what differentiates you in the marketplace there. Because anybody else can also sell the coaching. Anybody else can also sell the consulting. But if you don't differentiate yourself with your own expertise and with your own inputs and how you have managed to make sense of your own world, you're not going to be able to influence anyone. And if you're ready to create a predictable, scalable marketing system that generates an abundance of new leads and you're nurturing, nurturing them effectively in an automated manner, I want you to click the button below in the email so you can schedule a call with me. Let me see where you are right now because you've been watching these videos, you've been reading these emails, you've been following my work. Let me see what you have created. No, no obligation. I just want to see where you are so that we can, uh, you know, move along in this journey. In the meantime, just really sit down with yourself and be honest. What is going to be your business model and how are you going to be showing up in the world? Because if you get it wrong right from the get go, guess what? Grand opening, grand closing. In the meantime, enjoy the rest of your day. Oh.